By the way, good morning. Great to be with you guys. I'm Aaron Perlman. What we have going on today is the start of December. It's had a November shakeout. We ended up with 72 degrees for an average high. The, the low on average was 45.7. It's a little bit of warmer than I would have liked it to be. Hottest temperature was 83 degrees. The coldest was 36. That was just the other day on the 26th. And then rainfall amounts, we didn't get, we only got a trace last night. Uh, 200 of an inch total. That put us about half an inch below normal for the month. We're still not in a drought, not worried about rain chances yet. Take a look at where we are now though today. 57 degrees cloudy. Uh, we're gonna keep uh, it clear tonight and then look for temperatures around 60 degrees for tomorrow. So a slight warm up. Still dealing with the remnants of yesterday's front with windy weather overhead, gusts up to 55 miles per hour. This is going to continue to be the case in areas of the Tatchbees into the Grapevine until 10 a.m. This wind has come out of the northwest, then it starts to diminish and less of it is around us. It will be breezy throughout the mountain areas for sure. There's the cloud deck that's being pushed up against out of the northwest from that passing front that came by. As it's moved away here, you can see it out towards our east. We're still dealing with the trough, but what's going to happen is, is this ridge is going to strengthen and it's going to move overhead and allow for our skies to remain clear over the next day or two. In fact, if we pan out a bit further, you'll see any cloud activity, shower activity way up to the north. We're going to be dealing with more mostly clear skies until a few high clouds do roll in coming in by midweek. But uh, there's no rain coming our way. Everything's pretty quiet. Let's recap for just a second here. Windy conditions for the mountain areas. We are cooler and cloudier. 50s with low 6, 40s overnight. But next week will be dry. In fact, we'll get mild uh, around the area. As temperatures are going to jump towards the mid 60s by the beginning and middle of next week, maybe near 70 degrees. Just cooler weather for the start of this, this week is where we're at. Now, you can learn more about this online, bakersfieldnet.com. When you click the weather link, I would just wear something warm, whatever you do, for the rest of the day.